Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Open Potato, and here we check out the latest and the greatest strategy games each and every day of the week. Today, we are having another look at Captain of Industry, for which the beta has just dropped, which brings a whole bunch of brand new content, including, most interestingly, uh, nuclear power and also uh, a couple of brand new maps, which is great. Uh, new Haven is the uh, is the OG one, the one that you start on in the alpha. Uh, the beach, the Golden Peak, and You Shall Not Pass have uh, have been added, all to uh, varying degrees of difficulty. Uh, interestingly, very interestingly, in fact, uh, what you do is you start on uh, you know very various areas which are somewhat constrained, and you need to sort of try and branch out. Uh, before you run out of uh, resources, we're gonna try the Golden Peak. No guarantees that it's gonna that it's gonna work out, but we're gonna give it a shot, right? Game difficulty. We'll leave it all on Captain, and then we'll just sort of jump on into the game. Uh, yeah, we'll explore the changes as we go through. There's a couple of new buildings that have been added. Um, in fact, there's a lot of new buildings that have been added. I believe that there's probably a few more encounters as well that we need to that we need to keep an eye out for. Uh, when we are sailing the uh, the seven seas and so we're just gonna we're just gonna go with the flow We're gonna we're gonna roll with it. We're gonna see how things go Oh, a, a brand new level of settlement has also been added as well. So we can now level up to uh, Settlement level three, which is quite exciting. Okay, uh, first thing to check out is the map I mean, what is going on here? We've got this little this little plateau. It's not much of a plateau I suppose, but it's a little a nice little area that we can start with there is what looks like uh, a relatively small hill over here. Uh, we should really have a look at the resources as well and see what's going on. So what do we got? We got a bunch of, what is this, groundwater I think here? Uh, yeah, groundwater there. We've got iron ore up to the back here. We've got a little bit of sand obviously. We've got some, is that copper? Yep, that looks like copper to me. There's a whole bunch of stuff up the hill as well. Gold? Again, I don't think, oh my lordy, look at how much gold there is up there. I can't even... I can't even zoom out to, to show you how much gold there is. That's a heck of a lot of iron as well. Uh, there is a lot of coal up here. Doesn't look like there is much, if any, oil. Maybe I'm just missing it. Doesn't look like there's much. Uh, I don't think that that's oil over there. I think that's coal. Uh, oh, no, tell a light. There is a tiny little, a tiny little squeak of oil over there, which we do need to which we do need to keep in mind. Uh, okay, I I think we can be I think we can be reasonably happy with uh, with how this is all looking. So what do we need to do? Well, I think that we need to terraform this area uh, pretty much as quickly as we possibly can. Uh, we are going to get a we are going to get a few bits and bobs set up immediately. What do we get here? Start recycling. We're going to get concrete slabs. Uh, from that as well. Uh, right, what do we want to start with? Well, I mean, we need to assign we need to assign a couple of pickups to tree harvesting, but I think it's probably worth it's probably worth us maybe getting the research lab down first, just as just as something to do. Let's get it down. Let's get it down over there. Yeah, uh, we do have. Hold on, we do have. Um, we do have some emails to check out. Yeah, blast furnaces, research lab. Uh, trading, a trading, a trading dock as soon as possible. Okay, that might be new as well. I don't think that I can remember that from from earlier. Uh, we can start recycling, but let's maybe let's maybe set up let's maybe set up the let's maybe set up the blast furnace setup. I think uh, we're gonna try and keep this area roughly free for uh, for housing. So maybe if I if I sort of start the construction process straight ahead here, I guess that that's probably that's probably okay. Uh, I don't want to build. I don't want to build too big, just in case we end up. Uh, we end up using too much space. So we'll yoink that in there, that in there. And that gives us a pretty decent amount of steel. Although now that I think about it, if I'm being honest, we're probably going to want to have it at this side, even if it is a little bit more inconvenient to get it placed over here, just because. Uh, we're gonna want to expand out to this side anyway. Okay. That's looking good. Coal maker, we will need coal for the furnace. We will need metal scrap and also coal as well. So let's yoink that in there, sure. And then it's just a case of connecting everything up and getting a smokestack in the appropriate place. Yoink that in there. I think, I think that's everything. I think that is everything. Uh, that that can be connected with a conveyor belt when we get it, but I don't believe 
but we have a conveyor belt yet, so... I hope that that connects up fine. Uh, I don't think that there's going to be any issues with that. Yoink that in there. Yoink that in there. Although, we should probably go up and then down so that we can... So that we can manage the output, uh, so that we can manage the output from here into there. Okay, I think I think we're ready to I think we're ready to go. It's not gonna be, it's not gonna be huge, but it's at least gonna it's at least gonna work. All right, and we will start we will start deconstructing this in just a moment. Research lab. We'll get the research lab started as soon as we possibly can. We don't have anything. We don't have anything to uh, to get food from at the moment. That's fine. That's not a problem. Let's have a little look at the research lab and see what we can see what we can get. Right, construction. Do I want to get construction? Do I want to start making construction parts? Not particularly. Vehicles and mining. I think we need to prioritize vehicles and mining. Right. I think that's got to be the that's got to be the priority. Yeah, we got to start moving. We got to start moving land as, as quickly as we possibly can. We are going to see a little bit of a, a loss of unity because we're not able to feed our settlement with food. But uh, I mean, that's fine to be honest. We'll just make do. Let's assign you to tree harvesting and let's prioritize tree harvesting. Let's prioritize tree harvesting in this area so that we've got a little bit of a clear run up uh, to get a ramp to get a ramp built. I've, I think I've I think I've I've got an idea about what I'm what I'm gonna do. Let's get you assigned to tree harvesting as well, and we should be ready to go. We should be ready to go. Let's start recycling the abandoned communication station. Let's get rid of all of these alerts. Unity is still okay. Unity is very very okay. It is food that I am uh, that I am slightly worried about. But that's that's all right. Uh, is it maybe worth another research lab? We do have plenty of workers free, so... I kind of feel like that's not the worst idea in the world. Oh, we can also toggle the imports and exports from trucks, which is pretty darn nice. If I do indeed say so myself. Ground is not flat enough. Right, let's get a second research lab. We got the construction parts to do it. Let's... Let's chance it. Right, so the coal maker is going to give us coal. It's going to give us, what, four coal every 40 seconds. And we need to use four coal every 20 seconds in order to make eight iron. And I know that that makes eight iron every 40 seconds. So I've balanced this at least somewhat well. Uh, but I think we're going to need another coal maker. Well, we want another coal maker if we want to make... Uh, if we want to make this wood pretty continuously. Pickup cannot reach destination. Yeah, is that maybe a bad place to put this? I feel like it actually kind of is. Yeah, maybe just yoink that over there and, uh... Yeah. Cool. Okay. So that does that does take down the, the number of uh, bits and bobs that we've got takes down the number of construction parts a little bit but that's fine how much food have we got 56 food that's fine that's fine we're okay with this we're very very okay with this we're about to start work we're about to start work on truck export is on auto truck import is on uh, auto brilliant so it should it should transfer we should see the coal being moved between between locations that is the dream uh, he says that is the dream. Is it gonna work? Are we gonna are we gonna move the coal? It might require it might require just a little bit more before we do actually move it because I know that sometimes it does require that. Anyway, that's not a that's not a big deal. That's not a big deal at all. What do we got? We got recipes over here. Oh, that's cool. A little a nice little recipe icon. I like that a lot. How's the map looking? Maps looking kind of similar. There's a settlement over here. We can actually immediately make trades. Uh, well, as soon as we get a trading dock, that is, which we have been advised to build uh, somewhat rapidly. Oh, look at look at that. There we go. We're moving 12 coal. Beautiful. That works like an absolute dream. And now we will start start making iron. Cool. All right. So after we get done with vehicles and mining, uh, we probably need to get construction parts on the go. In fact, we should probably check out the research tech tree just to sort of see uh, the order of things that we're going to go in. Uh, you know, I should do I should do farming. I should do farming. Trading dock is there. Okay, that's good. And then we'll get then we'll get construction. Then we'll get construction. 
Okay. Okay. This is this is fine. This is fine. I do also need to get I do also need to get a setup uh, to store a couple of items. But that's fine. These are both working as they should be. Brilliant. Okay, vehicles and mining research has been completed. Let's have a little look. So, mine control tower is what we need and we need the mine control tower to be we need it to be pretty much there actually yeah we need it to be pretty much here the reason that we need it to be pretty much here is because we need to try and mine out the coal at the same time Ooh, interesting what can be dumped here we can actually set the we can set things okay we want to kind of try and i mean is it possible to do is it possible to mining designate this area? All the edges are too deep below the terrain. Yeah, I kind of worried about that. Kind of worried about that. Let's um let's see if we can try and let's see if we can try and fix this. I mean, we can definitely we can definitely dump stuff in this in this vicinity. That's definitely an option. Uh, dumping designation, I mean, you know, we can dump we can dump down here for example. I mean, that looks that looks absolutely perfect. And then we can start mining. Start mining maybe over here. There we go. Try that, eh? Try that. Okay. So we've got two. We got two ways. We got two ways of getting to an elevated. Got two ways of getting to an elevated position. We can either do it through dumping stuff, or we can do it through uh, digging stuff. And most importantly, that coal is going to be useful because we're going to be able to feed it directly into the blast furnace. Very important. Right, uh, iron ore is available up here. We have a limited time frame to get the iron ore sorted as well because the metal scrap in this abandoned communication station will not last forever. But that's okay. That's fine. We're still chopping. We're still chopping. Let's get the... Uh, let's... No, we should we should dump everything. Dirt, rock, uh, slag. Yep, get it all get it all dumped. Brilliant, brilliant. And in fact, slag is an output. Slag is an output when we change the recipe to be iron ore coal uh, to equal molten iron slag. Okay, so we do actually need to try and get a little bit of iron ore, kind of soon. Uh, it would also be good if we could get a vehicle depot up and running, but I'm not going to build that quite yet because I'm going to hold off until we get... until we get the ability to build farms because I think that a farm is, at the moment, slightly more important. I think. Don't quote me on that, but I think I think that it is. And we will get it, we will get it momentarily. We got 50 food left. We got 50 food left. I mean, that's fine. Uh, we also need to bear in mind the uh, the fact that maintenance is going to start to go down, which is not exactly great. It's got a nice little nice little early game boost, which is great. Let's have a little look at farming. Right. Uh, this is this is tight, actually. This is a temporary. This is a temporary farm location. I want to make that abundantly clear to everyone. This is a temporary farm location. We'll set up the cycle. We'll get, uh, I don't know, just, well, don't do manure first. Do, yeah, just do do on and off. That's fine. No, no big deal. We could deteriorate the, the soil if we wanted to, but I'm not particularly interested in doing that. Get that delivered. Uh, we will need water, which we have absolutely no way to get at the moment. So there's pretty much no reason to, no reason to worry about it. You know, don't worry what you can't control. That's fine. And then we will get a vehicle depot, but we're going to wait for the construction tech first because we kind of desperately need the ability to construct more construction components. Because if we don't, then uh, if we don't build more components, then we are stuffed, basically. We're going to have nothing else to do. Uh, again, farm's not going to work until we get until we get rain, and there's no rain on the, uh, on the forecast, unfortunately. So we're going to have to just... Pray that it rains. Trading dock or power? I think trading dock, given that this is the this is the brand new I believe the brand new building anyway. Okay. The good news 
Let's pause and uh, and recap what we've got that's brand new. Assembly. Manual assembly. Let's get this let's get this set up. We'll do We'll do this here. Again, we will hopefully be able to convert this area into some some form of an automated setup once we get conveyor belts, which uh, I don't think that we're necessarily far off from, but it would be, you know, it would be nice if we could immediately sort of jump into a, jump into a setup with conveyors once we get them. And the good news is, is that we've been producing iron plates this entire time, so we should have absolutely no issues Absolutely no issues jumping into things and getting everything set up. Uh, also, I'm just realizing we don't have any... We don't have any storage. We don't have any storage for anything, but that's fine. Not a big deal. We'll get storage soon, no doubt. Right. Iron and wood should be coming through here. Do we have enough... Do we have enough wood collection? Do we have enough wood collection? Or am I going to need to get another... Another truck for for wood. Yeah, it's just wood that we're missing. It's wood that we're missing. I tell you what, let's get another let's get another tree harvesting truck. No real reason not to, right? We've got a couple of trucks that are just sort of lying around doing absolutely nothing. Might as well put them to put them to good use. There we go. Now we're talking. Truck cannot find any trees to harvest. I mean, you can harvest any one of the trees. Like you don't need to. You don't need to worry about just harvesting. Just harvesting the trees that I've marked. I mean, that's very kind of you to just do exactly what I say, but that's, yeah, not required. Okay, we got a trading dock. Heck yeah, look at that. And also the storage. Wow, how convenient. Right, so the trading dock. Ground is not flat enough. Where do we want to get the trading dock? It's got to be here, right? Let's try and stick it as far out into the ocean as we possibly can. Only cost us 10 construction parts. 180 wood, though. That's a little... That's a little steep, don't you think, video game? Let's get another... Let's get another tree on tree harvesting. More metal scrap. Brilliant. Keep it coming, keep it coming, keep it coming. We're venting a whole bunch of very, very noxious gases. Uh, air pollution. Is that a thing? I know that it's contributing to air pollution, but I don't think that it's a thing. Hallelujah. The rains, the rains are falling. That's great news for the farm. That is excellent, excellent, excellent news for the farm. Uh, plus, we're getting construction components, which is going to sort us right out. That's great. Yeah, happy, happy days. Right. So, after that, it's very, very simply a case of getting the vehicle depot set up over here. And we're going to want to order a couple of excavators. Probably two, I imagine. Uh, and the reason that we're going to want to get two is because we are going to want to get one... We're going to want to get one truck probably working in this area. We're also probably going to get a second mine control tower. Which is... Going to be solely responsible for mining the iron. We'll get this over there. Again, being conscious of the fact that I have a whole bunch of groundwater here, which does need to be extracted at some point. Also, we've got limestone up here. What is limestone used for? I don't know if limestone's used for uh, for anything yet. We'll see. Oh, research, 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 research. Uh, power and maintenance, concrete production. We can't make concrete production until we get power and maintenance, so uh, I guess we should probably do that. Maintenance, of course, being the, uh, the bane of my life. But it's fine. We'll we'll learn to love it, no doubt. Right. We're waiting material delivery. And I tell you what, we're probably definitely going to cut back on the number of trees, uh, tree, tree cutting trucks that we have. Because uh, we are doing a great job of chopping down the trees. But we are doing a poor job at servicing all of the other delivery routes. Right, the good news is, is that we can now trade here. We can upgrade this uh, this town if we get some more construction parts, but we don't have that yet, that's fine. Okay, that's good. And we can, we can, uh, we can use Unity, and we do need to make sure, we do need to make sure that we get, uh, we get an appropriate, an appropriate stockpile on the go. This ship needs to be repaired too. Yeah, okay, we need to, we need to work on that. Right. 
Let's make this excavator. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's unassign you from tree harvesting. That's fine. Truck can't find any more trees to harvest. That's cool. Start chopping down this area here. Mine control tower is coming along just nicely. The farm is not doing great. Can last eight months without water. I mean, that's good news, theoretically. We've only played this game for about 12 months. Is it going to survive without water? I, I don't know. Right, let's queue this up afterwards. Let's pause just whilst I'm doing that. Uh, copper refinement, basic diesel. I think we probably want a beacon first. Then we will get copper. Then we'll get basic diesel. Then we'll get a ship dock. Then we'll get construction two. Then we'll get cement production. I mean, sure. Let's just add everything. Every single bit of thing to the to the research uh, queue. Also, when do I get... When do I get belts? Where the heck do I get belts from? Up here? Wow, that's... Further than I remember? Maybe it's not, but sure as heck feels like it. Okay, we got the... We've got it. We've got the excavator. Brilliant. Let's go. Let's freaking go. And we'll get the second one in just a second. Good stuff. Good stuff. Doing, doing a great job. Doing a great, 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 great job. Right, what are you loading up? You're loading up with coal? I mean, that's fine and dandy, but we don't actually have any requirement for coal yet, which is... Uh, I don't want to say it's it's not a problem, per se. That's power, by the way, that we just completed. I don't think that we require power for anything. Not yet, anyway. I'm sure we will. This is looking good, looking good. Lots of iron coming through. That's fine and dandy. The crops are going to grow. Harvest in 3.3 months. I hope we get a heck of a lot of food. 35 food? I mean, it's not tons, but it's, it's not far off. Truck can't find any trees to harvest. Okay, just now we can start working through the, you know, the bulk of the trees. The large body of trees. All right. 41 iron. We're getting there. 60 iron. Okay, we are good to go. We are good to go on both of the fronts that matter. Uh, these coal makers can be paused. There's absolutely no reason to maintain these coal makers because we can make coal much more efficiently by digging it up. There we go. Okay, no mining designations. Oh yeah, that's true. Uh, also, cargo docks. Oh, yeah, that's just the... It's just got a little trading dock in. That's cool. Okay. Uh, we will get a maintenance depot down in just a second, but let me sort out the mining designation. That's the dumping designation. No. Right. This is a this is a pretty simple setup, to be honest. We just need to yoink this up here. And that's it. That's going to get us... That's going to get us iron. We got one truck assigned, one, one bulldozer assigned. Let's unassign you from tree harvesting. Let's unassign you from tree harvesting because let's be... In fact, let's be honest. We, we can unassign everyone from tree harvesting. We don't need anyone. Uh, we've just unlocked concrete production. Apparently, we're just going super freaking fast. Oh, look at this. Crusher. Slag crush. That's brand new. Rainwater harvester. Now, that is, that is, kind, of, that is kind of essential. Rainwater harvester. Let's get one of those down pretty useless given that we don't have any ability to store the water yet but <laughs> it's cool uh, construction parts also need to be sorted let's get a let's get a there we go storage for construction parts so we can just continue to so we can continue to store them continue to use them very very important right we're digging up a little bit of dirt i'm actually very okay with that very okay with digging up a little bit of dirt. Uh, the reason, of course, let's assign another truck. Uh, the reason that, that I'm okay with uh, assigning assigning dirt is because we're going to start dumping it and we're going to start being able to get up to the next level. Pretty, pretty important. Right. Uh, what's the issue here? Oh. Wait, what? Why 
did we decide to stop accepting? Hmm, very strange. Not quite sure why that happened, but hey ho. Rainwater harvester, that's looking good, and we should be able to eke out the uh, the farming duration of the farm for at least a little bit longer, which is quite important. Uh, trucks are doing a whole bunch of dumping. We've got two trucks assigned to this to this mining tower now. This is great. We've got 33 workers available, 16 months of food supply, uh, 90 population. We're starting to build the ramp up to the next level. We're actually using the coal that we're digging out here. That's real good. That is real, real, real good. And we're doing a whole bunch of research. And our unity is increasing. How crazy is that? How crazy is that? So what have we actually done? Concrete production we've finished. Do I need concrete production? I, I figure I probably do. I figure I probably do need concrete production. Uh, I mean, how on earth do we make concrete? Because they've changed it, right? Oh, we need cement plus slag crushed. But we can't make cement. We do have cement, though. But we also have a whole bunch of concrete slabs that are just chilling. That are just chilling here. Like, we haven't needed to do anything with concrete slabs. I presume concrete slabs are maybe used for... Well, we, we could build the beacon. I mean, that's not what they're used for, it, though. Uh, we should also get a maintenance uh, depot here as well. Let's build that. Build that over there. Yeah. Small excavator has no reachable destinations. Uh... What? Is that really not possible? I feel like it should be. Add that. Is it maybe because I've not started at zero? There we go. Is that the problem? Who knows? I'm not sure what the problem is. But anyway, uh, I think that should be good enough. Yeah, we should should be good enough. Right, iron. What's what's wrong here? Oh, that's wrong. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, we'll keep using metal scrap. And to be honest, we're going to double up this entire setup in just a second. Because we really want to start... Uh, well, we want to start using slag. Slag is going to be slag is going to be pretty darn useful. But we need to get rid of this, this communication station first. Yeah, we absolutely do. Uh, we should also probably make a storage depot for the concrete slabs as well just so that we can clear it up that's pretty important you can oh my god have i messed up all of these mining designations what's going on is that what's what you just can't mine the you can't eat into the rock is that is that the dealio? You just you're just not happy. I mean, I, I maybe they've changed the way that um, that excavators work. I didn't think that was the case. Oh, is it maybe because you're in a little bit of a rut here? Is that the problem? Is that the issue? Okay, no. Uh, let's go. Cancel this. I feel like you might have gotten stuck here, actually. You manage that? Oh, no. Hold on. Uh... What about this? This is yeah, this is funky. Uh, are you seriously are you seriously stuck in here? This is. What about you dig up there? Unassigned control tower. Okay, no. Uh. -huh. Also, we need power. We need power for the maintenance setup. That's uh, that's a problem. 
Okay, assign you there. Where is the destination? Where 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 are you trying to go? Where are you trying to go to? Where are you trying to go to? No mining designations. Yeah, yeah no, I get it. I get it. I get it. Uh, that's really really strange. I mean, I feel like I feel like this should be easily fixable, but um, just just ain't. You wanna try that instead? Nope, absolutely, absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, there's some some similar shenanigans happening over here. But to be honest, I'm I'm quite content just to let this just to let this slide. You're just gonna mine down to that base level, and then you're just gonna continue to dump out over here. That that is that is fine with that is absolutely fine with me. I feel like what I need to do, what I feel like what I need to do, hold on, this is an idea. We're gonna start with like a level. Rotate around, if possible. Right. And then we're going to see if we can try and go... See if we can try and go up from here. Try that. Try that. Will that make any difference? Mm, not really. Recover. There we go. Try that. And assign. Right. Don't know why that worked, but here's hoping that it's fixed now. Here's hoping that it's fixed now. Okay, you're still doing fine. That's great. Happy days. We do need more scale. We need more of absolutely everything. Uh, we're maxing out the amount of iron that we've got here. Missing input. Oh, I tell you what. We need a tree to do tree harvesting. That's uh, that's still part of the problem, isn't it? That's why we're not turning any of these iron bars into flipping construction components. Uh, but that's fine. Uh, I'd love to build. I'd love to build a storage area specifically for iron, but unfortunately, I can't do that. I'm not allowed. Not yet, anyway. Oh, look at that. It's fixed. Don't know what happens, but we're back. We're back. That's good. Okay, we're getting iron ore. We're getting iron ore at the ground. Brilliant. Getting copper. No, we're not getting copper. Not yet. We're getting coal. Coal ore out the ground. That's cool. We're actually converting our iron ore into iron plates. And we are converting those iron plates into construction parts. Through the use of a couple of concrete slabs, but not many. I do feel like we need something. Also, fluid storage is now is now a go. Let's get. Let's get some fluid storage over here. There we go. Nice. How much food have we got? 35 food. That's pretty decent. Uh, we might not have the construction components for a wee while, but that's okay. Right. How are we doing maintenance-wise? We're still doing okay maintenance-wise. We're still above 100%. We do need to get power set up. Diesel generator. I don't really, I don't really want to or need to do anything with diesel. Uh, we definitely need another manual assembly area. For sure. What am I looking for? Assembler. There we go. Yeah, definitely need an additional one of those. Ship dock repair plus two. What is that going to give us? Enables you to repair the ship. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. 100 construction components. That's definitely changed. That's... I say it's definitely changed. I feel like it's changed. I feel like it's become... I feel like it's become less... What do we got? Lots of molten iron and not enough, not enough uses for molten iron. Well, that's what happens. That is what happens. Right, well, the rainwater is looking great. Can we set up... We can't set up water inputs with pipes, can we? No, we cannot set up water inputs with pipes. Do we just want to... Deliver water truck export on... Yeah, do we not want to deliver water via truck? That would seem to me to be a sensible idea, but uh, but alas. Maybe we can't import it. Maybe we can't import it to the base level farm. That's 
yeah, to supply water from external source, it needs to be upgraded. Okay, so the, the rainwater collector at the moment is pretty useless. It will become useful because we're going to get concrete uh, production in just a second. But for now, not super, not super useful. It does make me think that maybe we should try and get another farm. If that's the, if that's the case. An additional farm just to sort of help hurry things along a little bit. Get a, uh, what am I looking for? A storage place in here. And we will store iron. Beautiful. Now that is going to allow this blast furnace to pretty continuously run. I hope. That's the dream. Right. How close are we to getting rid of this? Quite far. Quite, quite, quite far. How's this area looking? Not too bad. I mean, it's looking... It's looking a little... It's looking a little funky, but the important thing is that we're building up the ramp. That's what, that's what matters. That's what matters. Should maybe cut down on... Yeah, cut down on that area. Instead, just work on this ramp here. There we go. How are we doing? How are we doing iron-wise? No issues, actually. No issues iron-wise. Loads of iron ore. Loads and loads and loads of iron ore, which is exactly to be expected because uh, we're currently doing a pretty poor job of turning our iron ore into, into iron plates because we're not doing it fast enough. Should we get another? I feel like we absolutely should get another blast furnace here. Yeah, let's get another blast furnace. It's probably long overdue. Let's get it... Let's get it here. There is groundwater here. There is groundwater here, but it's fine. Copper electrolysis. We got copper production as well to look forward to. Uh, oh man. We got a lot of... We got a lot of stuff. We got a lot of stuff to be to be mindful of. We also need to be super conscious of the fact... Let's get... We also need to be super conscious of the fact that we need to get cement production set up and we have a limited number of workers that will do work. Oh, I've done it the wrong way around. Deconstruct. What a twit. It might not be perfectly level, but I mean, at this point, I'm not super inclined to care, actually. Okay. This feels good. This feels very, very, this feels very, very good. Very, very nice indeed. Uh, we could really, we could help. We could help ourselves by getting a few more, a few more excavators. But the excavators are only going to... Only gonna matter if we're able to move more resources, and uh, we need more. We need more iron. And this this one should probably burn just iron ore and coal. This blast furnace, that is. Great. Cement production, and then conveyor belts after, for sure. It's got to be conveyor belts. It's got to be conveyor belts. But uh, we're not gonna be able to. We're not gonna be able to build them quite yet because we need construction part twos, I believe. We also need to get a copper copper mine set up. Man, a lot of stuff is a lot of stuff is happening. A lot of stuff is happening. It's very important. A lot of stuff is happening, very important, but it's working. Everything is coming together. Everything is coming together. Very very nicely indeed. Uh, can upgrade to electric. Not sure that we need that yet. How are we doing maintenance wise? 206% yeah, we're fine. We're fine for maintenance. No valid destination for iron ore. Not for long. That'll be fixed. That'll be fixed very, very soon indeed. Prioritize that. Don't worry too much about the smokestack. Not for now. Can always worry about that later. Okay. This is going well. This needs to be... Needs to be doing better. 
I mean, you're just chilling around. Let's let's assign another truck over here, I guess. I mean, it's not going to make a huge difference, but it's fine. It's fine. How are we doing for food? We're fine for food. We're totally, totally fine for food. In fact, we're so fine for food that we should probably use this rainwater harvester for what it's actually intended for, and that is to make that is to make concrete. But we've got another 160 concrete slabs to go, so we're still okay. Oil pump, yeah, we need to get the oil pump and the basic distiller up and running. Uh, I mean, the oil pump, it just needs to straight up go here, doesn't it? We only have eight workers available, so before we do before we do that, before I end up torpedoing my ability to recruit people, let's get a let's get a beacon, a beacon to start uh, recruiting just a few more folk. We don't want too many because bear in mind that our farm is it is good, uh, but we could probably get a yeah irrigated farm. Let's let's get that up. Let's get that up next. Everything else is sort of just a bonus at this stage. Everything is working. Everything is running. Very important. Coal, we are doing great for coal, but we could probably do with an additional coal truck, if I'm honest. And we could do with unassigning... Unassigning you. There we go. Nice. Not enough maintenance. Who's not being maintained? Who is not being maintained? That, that worries me. That worries me greatly. Beacon is ready. Okay. Good. Now we're ready to get the power set up. This is this is pretty important. Uh, we'll get a power generator. Get a power generator here. And then what we'll do is we will fix the tree removal to just give us a little more space over here. We'll get the mine. We'll get the mining set up sorted in just a second. How much copper do we have? 290 copper. We got plenty of copper. So we can actually do... We can do a tiny little bit of maintenance. Who's not got the maintenance? I bet you it's one of the bulldozers. Yeah, it's the bulldozer. Uh, not the bulldozer, the excavator. Uh, but that's that's okay. Yeah, we can do a tiny little bit of maintenance. Uh, it's not a big deal. We can do maintenance with our copper and with our iron. Uh, we can do that right now. Even though we don't have a copper setup, it does kind of worry me a little bit that we don't have a copper setup, but I mean, let's be real. We should prep for it. Let's get one of those. Let's get one, two, three, four of those. And with that, I hope that we will be able to sustain a copper setup and maybe do a few other, a few other bits and bobs as well. Right. We should see a delivery of we should see a delivery of resources in just a second. We got iron plates. This probably should be bumped up the priority list a little bit. Priority two, maybe. Yeah. I feel like it should be appropriately high. Yeah. Here it comes. This has got to be the one. Perfect. Okay, we're going to start recruiting. That's great. Conveyor belts are are good. Beacon is on. We have five workers. We have five workers remaining. Repeat, we have five workers remaining. That feels like we got in there just in the nick of time, to be honest. Just in the nick of time. Mine control tower. We're going to get a second one or a third one even in just a second. We got quite, quite long queues occurring right now. Uh, we have one truck that is just sitting here doing absolutely nothing. Which makes me think that that's not a great vibe, but that's okay. Uh, we do have conveyors, which is great. But that's fine. Okay. Let's let's have a little look at the... Oh my goodness, a rotary kiln. That Oh, I see. Limestone makes cement. Very cool. Okay, well, we can't do that yet because we have nowhere near enough, uh, nowhere near enough stuff. Right. Let's get you... Yeah. In that position right there. Am I going to be able to do... Am I going to be able to do the unthinkable? Am I going to be able to cover... I think I might be able to cover... What am I looking... 
potato, stop, stop, potato, stop. There we go. I think I might be able to cover the mind control tower. Yeah, look at that. The mind control tower is going to be able to cover sand, which is going to be super important right now. Not a dumping designation, a mining designation. Let's get uh, flats. There we go. So sand is going to be super important right now for the concrete mixer. Slag crushed gravel. Uh, so I still need to crush. I still need to crush slag somehow. I, I don't really. I don't know. I, I mean, we the slag absolutely needs to come from here. I presume that we can also crush just regular rock into gravel, which is fine. Sure. Is that a? It's not a molten channel. It's a U-shaped conveyor, which we can't build yet. That's fine. Okay, so we'll turn... Sure, we'll turn both of them into... Both of them into... What needs what it needs to be turned into. Let's get a... Let's get a pipe here. Let's build up, 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 up. And then down. I hope that that will give us enough space to play around. Maintenance is not in a great place, but it's being improved very rapidly, in fact. We've got three workers that are available. Uh, expecting six refugees in less than a month. That's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. That's exactly what we need. That is great. Beautiful. Okay, we've got 16 months of food. What's our, what's our population cap? 120? You know what? I think, I think we'll be fine. I think we will be just fine. Yeah. Nice. Right, so you can get to work here. Start getting sand. Nice. Get a truck assigned. And we'll get that crusher built in just a moment. Maintenance is looking good. Maintenance is looking good. Right, irrigated farms. Irrigated farms we are currently working on. I would love to get an upgrade. I'd love to get an upgrade to irrigated farms. And to be honest, I, I mean, even thinking maybe we just need to get straight up another farm to ensure that we're able to maintain... maintain production of, of food. Not in love with that idea. Concrete mixer has no recipe selected. Yeah, let's get... Uh, Oh, we could do it with two cement. I, I feel like two cement is a bad idea. Let's uh, let's get the recipe that either involves crushed slag or crushed gravel. Yeah. Right, so the crusher should be able to operate now as well. There we go. Now we're talking. That's looking, that's looking great. We don't want to crush... We don't want to crush everything, though. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set this mining vehicle to do... Hold on. Yeah, let's... We're going to do a little... We're going to do a little bit of mining down here. In fact, hold on. Is this going to get us... Is this going to get us up to the top just as is? This might be fine. I'm just a little bit worried that if we don't... Oh, settlement is overcrowded. That's a bit of a problem. Uh, if we don't start mining down here and we don't start getting dirt, then we might not be able to complete this little ramp. I hope we will be able to, though, because, I mean, it's pretty darn important uh, that we get access to the next area, but that's fine. Okay, sand is looking good. Cement is not quite good, but it will be soon. We've got 26 workers that are free, and we've just brought online a whole bunch of additional pickup trucks. Although I note that we are... We're not even low on rubber or on copper, which is fine. The communication station is almost up. We just have a lot of stuff in the queue to, to go through. That's fine. That's fine. Absolutely fine. Okay, irrigated farms and refugees. We are, we're good on both, both counts there. 
Let's get a unit storage set up just so that we can automate this properly when, when the time comes. Time is not now, but it will come soon. I tell you what I could do. I could actually, instead of just sticking sand, so we're not going to be able to store sand in the unit storage, irritatingly. Um, we'll have to get the special special storage. In fact, this this storage right here, loose storage. Yeah, we'll we'll get that. We'll get that right now. Instead of instead of doing that, we could dump sand. We could dump sand over here. Okay, the real test is going to be are we going to be able to tree harvest over here? I think we're flipping close here. I think we're going to get I think we're going to get up here, you know that? Ah, good stuff. The small excavator is doing a is doing a grand job. That's that's a nice that's a nice change, actually. That's that's quite handy. Right, let's let's de-designate these trees here, and we'll see if we can actually make it up to the up to the top. That's gonna be the that's gonna be the test. The test of greatness. Right, but everything else is looking great. We are basically just ready. We're just ready to kick this. We're ready to kick this thing into overdrive. What do we need in order to get the uh, the electric assembly? Well, we can build the electric assembly right now. We just need copper. We need copper processing. Pickup cannot reach destination. Mm, okay, that's irritating. That's irritating. I thought we were. I thought we were there. I thought we were there. We're close, but we're not quite there yet. We're we're almost there. We're almost there. Don't worry. Don't worry. We can we can do it. We can do it. As soon as this truck is able to is able to rock and roll, we'll know that we've succeeded. Okay. Uh, turn off this flipping beacon. Turn off this beacon. Turn off this beacon. This is this is not good. This is not good. Uh, this is gonna be lowering unity pretty dramatically. I was not envisioning increasing my population at all. Uh, actually, in this episode, I was gonna play it really, really, really careful. Uh, really, really, really slow. Not slow, but I was really gonna try and... gonna try and play it safe. But alas, that has, um... that has not exactly worked out, irritatingly. Truck still can't, still can't go yet? No. No. Oh, it's so close though, isn't it? It's so close. It it's it's ready to go. It's it's ready to rock and roll, you know. Let's have a look. Nice. Come on. Let's let's get up there. Let's get up there. That would be such a great such a great place to be. Yeah, so we got 16 months of food. How do we upgrade to an irrigated farm? Yeah, we need to get we need to get automated production. We need to get copper. Really, we do. We really, really need to. Okay, let's, um, let's pretend, let's pretend that everything is hunky-dory, and let's set up, let's set up an electric assembly area, and we'll start prepping to get construction parts too on the go, which, to be fair, we can do in, in a little bit. Okay, pickup still can't reach the destination. That you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Do I need to do I need to mine this out? That looks like it's so unbelievably reachable. Okay. Ditch that. Go go here. Go here. Go here. No, we don't want you to mine here. Go mine there. Go mine there. Come on, just just take a little. I take a little off the top, you know. Take a little off the top. Hey, I think that's. I think that's it. I think we've done it. I think we've done it. Yes, we've done it. We've done it. We've done it. Okay, we've done it. We have reached. We have reached it. The pickup truck is now. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. This is the tree harvesting pickup. It is gonna. It is gonna freaking go. Oh, that is brilliant. Oh, I am absolutely delighted. Okay. So, we've got access to this brand new area, which I was super worried that we would just not be able to do um, for reasons which will become very, very clear uh, shortly. That gets us access to so much stuff. That gets us access to so much stuff. Okay, groundwater, very important. Limestone, pretty important. Uh, a whole bunch of coal, which which is, I mean, it's going to be essential. It just, it just is. 
Uh, the next area that we probably want to get access to is like this plateaued area up here. But I mean, look, that, that is that is like a problem for another day. We, we have the coal. We have the coal that we need right now, and that's and that's perfect. Okay, so we can we can properly start excavating this area. There is no reason to there's no reason to not just absolutely tear the ground apart over here, which is exactly what we're going to do, uh, to be fair. Oh, that's that's great. That feels like a huge win. That feels like a really, really, really big win. Okay. We're actually making construction parts too. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We're making construction parts too, which is great, but we don't actually have a way to produce copper yet, which is uh, not worrying, but it's something that we should be, you know, aware of. Right, let's, let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. In order to produce, in order to produce copper, we need to throw copper into the metal caster, and then we need to throw it into the copper electrolysis. We actually lose a little bit of copper in the process, which is a little, a little irritating. Look, let's just get the, let's just get the basics set up. Again, I want to leave enough space that I'm not going to end up, you know, cursing my name when we need to properly automate this. Copper electrolysis. Nice. And you know what? I think I'm actually going to get another rainwater thingy over here because we're going to need another rainwater thingy which is of course the technical name also i need to get diesel production how, how much diesel do we have a, a pretty large amount to be fair we can always trade for more i suppose uh anyway i don't want to curse my name so i'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and automate most bits Right, and you are going to do just copper ore. Brilliant, 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 brilliant. We are on a low food supply. Uh, the first thing that we should really upgrade is is this farm. Yeah, it, it pretty much is. We need more construction components, missing input. Oh, yeah, we don't need to actually harvest wood from up here. I, I don't know why I'm still doing that. Uh, that was just a that was just a test. It was a test video game, and you passed. Great, congratulations. Let's, let's harvest the rest of the, the woods over here. That's cool. There is no way, as far as I'm aware, uh, to get lumber back. So once the lumber is gone, you gotta you gotta be super careful. Let's get you assigned to tree harvesting as well. The more tree harvesting operations we have, the merrier. Ooh, how did I make how did I make loose storage? Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Okay. So this is like bulk storage, and this is kind of great. Let's yoink that in there. Store sand. Perfect. And in fact, we could get another one that stores slag and or gravel. Because both can be stored. Both can be stored there. But let's, let's again, let's not worry about this too much at the moment. We need to make cement too. I need to make diesel as well. Oh, okay, let's do diesel. Do diesel. Do diesel. Diesel is an easy fix. Diesel is an easy fix. Let's nab this in there. And we get a basic distiller. The basic distiller is... Let's put some distance between it so that we can stick a fluid storage in the middle. Pretty perfect. Excellent. Uh, steam in the smokestack goes to here. Uh, yeah, there, it's fine actually. Nice waste water. Do I just want to want to store wastewater, or do I want to stick it into the ocean at the moment? I'm not sure that I really do. Right. How many construction parts do we have? Not enough. Not enough. We need to really upgrade this. We need to upgrade these uh, these manual assembly things up to level two, so that we can start building the construction parts level one quicker than we quicker than we currently are. We got a lot of stuff. We got a lot of stuff in the in the construction phase at the moment. Maybe, 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 maybe it's time that I consult my my trading my trading friends. Uh, 
nothing. Actually, literally, literally nothing that I want. Literally nothing that I want. Absolutely nothing. Wow, there is there is so much. There is so much to there is so much to do. I am just very worried that we're gonna run out of food. I am very worried. What needs to be prioritized? What needs to be prioritized highly? Not diesel, to be fair. Diesel's actually okay. It's a little bit of a misnomer that we're running out of diesel. Copper is important, because if we don't have copper, then we're not going to be able to make the electric assembly area. So that is, that is important. The truck queues are fine. We need a lot of construction component ones. How much does it cost me to get another manual assembly maker? It costs me 20 components. Maybe I get another one of those. I think I get another one of those. Prioritize that. That should theoretically mean that everyone is going to start to build the manual assembly machine first, which is great. Uh, harvest in 1.4 months. That's good. We should have enough. We should have enough rain to at least get another harvest in uh, before we completely run out of food. And then I'm really hoping that we're going to get enough construction component twos that we're going to be able to get away with an irrigated farm instead of worrying about a regular other farm. Although I'm now thinking that maybe. Maybe another regular farm just for just for backup purposes is kind of essential. Tutorial diesel production. I don't really need the tutorial for diesel production, thanks. I think I'm actually pretty au fait with almost everything that's going on at the moment. We're, we're fine on we're fine on most fronts. Oh, please, keep raining. Keep raining. Small excavator cannot reach the destination. What? Have I doofed this up as well? Alright, am I going to need to save you as well? Yeah, okay, I'm just going to save you too. Yeah, I, I've really mutilated the ground here. This is, this is not a great vibe. Not a great vibe at all, but that's okay. Right, so we're producing a whole heck of a lot of construction components. We just got that, we just got that harvest done, which is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful timing, if I do indeed say so myself. Very, very happy with that. And in fact, it's already farmed up. Let's get that prioritized. Uh, that's good. Warning, low diesel. That is true. That is true. But we do have the, the basic distiller that's, um, that's just come online, which is good. It does seem like we're... It does seem like we're in a little bit of a predicament. I feel like we're making a lot of construction components and yet they're just not going, they're not going to where I want them to go. Where are they going? I suppose they are going to the farm, which I did say to prioritize, which uh, kind of essential, I guess, actually, now that I think about it. You know what? I really probably shouldn't complain too much. Right, let's go potatoes, then let's go green manure. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay, we're probably not going to get the harvest done, you know, super quickly because, of course, it's not going to rain for at least a little while. You know, curse me, etc., etc. I'm very unfortunate that, uh, that the rain, the rain uh, has just fallen, but also fortunate that the rain has just fallen. Okay, how much copper do we have? We're fine for copper. We're fine for iron. Good. We got loads of iron in the storage in the storage area. In fact, we should probably have a storage area for copper as well. We'll worry about that in just a second. Uh, look, we are pumping out about as much about as much construction component uh, nonsense as we possibly can. This is this is pretty good. This is pretty good. How's our excavator doing? What's going on? <laughs> I hate this so much. <laughs> Oh, it's so bad. It's so bad. Okay, uh, can we do... Can we do this, maybe? We do that? Does that work? Oh, I didn't... Oh, I, I didn't assign it to the... I didn't assign it to the farm. When you recover... When you recover it, it, uh... When you recover... It 
just goes back. Just goes back to the base and does not get assigned. Okay. Reassigned it to the original work orders. That should be okay. We can recover every now and again for 0 0.5 unity. It's, it's not a big deal. Low food supply. Oh, don't I know it, video game. Don't I freaking know it. We're about to harvest the green manure. That's, that's fine. Very okay. 12 construction component twos. Copper. We're just about to get copper online. We need a few more workers in order to get copper electrolysis stuff going. Um... I guess we can stop the vehicle depot. That's that's not a big deal. Only one person required in the oil pump. Six required in the basic distiller. Yeah, we should manage to get all of this stuff done with the current number of people that we have. I think. And that's going to take us to a. It's going to take us to a pretty comfortable place. That is going to take us to a pretty comfortable place. We are not mining copper ore yet, which I maybe should change. Let's prioritize, prioritize this, prioritize this loose storage area. So then we can stack up a whole bunch of sand. Then we can change the, the mining designation of this, of this area and we can get that done. Okay. Pickup cannot reach destination. Oh, I was a little, I was a little worried for a second there. We'll recover you. Yeah, I have messed up the landscape. Something fierce over here. The, to be, f ooh, no, didn't mean to do that. To be fair, to be fair to myself. We got a ramp out of it, so I'm, you know, quite happy with that compromise. You know, that's that's fine. That's fine with me. What's up? Missing imports. We don't have any molten iron. We've got too much slag. Let's unassign you. Oh, do we have a dumping area? I don't think we have a dumping area. Yeah, we sure as heck do not have a dumping area. Uh, okay, I don't really want to dump over here because if I do dump over here, then I feel like it might end up just messing things up a little bit. But, you know, at the same time, I'm kind of like, we gotta try. We gotta try. You, no? You don't want to... Oh, there we go. That's That's what I was looking for. I, yeah, I want that vibe. That's the vibe that I'm after. Nice. Okay. And then, what do we allow dumping? We allow dumping of everything. Good. Okay, so everything should sort of splutter into action again. Warning low diesel. 52 diesel. Don't really love that, to be honest. Don't really love that. We've apparently pumped all the oil. Hold on. Crude oil. There's yeah, there's loads of there's loads in, in the in the reserve. We haven't pumped it all yet. Thought perhaps there was a visual issue with the with the pump looking like it was not completed, but actually was completed. Anyway, this is this is fine. This is great. This is this is fantastic. I am I am happy with this. We should also probably dumping designate you know, like, stuff around here. I mean, we should probably try and... <laughs> we should probably try and fix this. I, I don't know. I don't know how to fix this. This is... A, <laughs> this... I can feel this excavator is going to get lost again. Lost again down a deep, dark hole. I can... I can feel it. I can feel it coming a mile away. Okay. Right. We're pumping. That's great. Let's get distilling. Missing input. We need more crude oil. That's fine. We're gonna get, we're gonna get eight diesel to pop. Happy days. Happy, happy days. We do still need to get a wastewater area set up. We need to get a a pump, and um, we need to get it kind of fast because otherwise we're gonna have issues with power and we're gonna have issues with diesel. So I tell you what. Get that set up over there. Although I really would quite like to try and start automating a few of these processes. Alright, that's looking fine. Let's start thinking about copper as well. It's a lot of sand that we've got. How much concrete do we have? We've got a lot of concrete. Got a lot of concrete.
You're right. Do we want to go uphill? I think we want to try. Nice. Okay, a couple more loads of sand. That'll get us across the line. How are we doing in terms of food? Harvest in 3.7 months. Harvest in 1.5 months. Yeah, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. The rain is enough to get us across the line. So, you know, let's not... Let's not mess with that. That's that's good. That's good stuff. That is good stuff. Okay. Diesel is looking great. The pump can still be... Yeah, the pump can absolutely be... Uh, the the bits and bobs can be moved with with trucks. The wastewater can be moved by, by trucks. It's not a problem. I don't love it. I'd much rather use, use pipes. Um, but at the end of the day, I mean, if, if we have to, then we have to. Let's store diesel here. Again, this feels very, very temporary, as I say about most processes that I build, uh, but it, it, it actually is temporary. I, I promise. It actually is temporary. We definitely need more oil, but let's face it, we can probably get one more per- we, we literally have one more worker who can work if we want to. Uh, do we want them to work in oil? I don't particularly care. Uh, it's not- not a super large priority. 16 months of food supply. And then we got 1.3. We got we got food coming in 1.3 months. I think we've just, I think we've just about, I think we've just about saved it. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Construction part twos are, are coming online very, very, very shortly indeed. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. The only area that I'm not happy with is this area, which is, I mean, just getting worse and worse by the day. Oh my goodness. <laughs> It's so bad. It's so unbelievably bad. We're gonna have to fill it. Oh, it's, I don't. I don't even want to think. I don't even want to think about it. Yeah, yeah. Look at this. I don't. <laughs> I don't even want to think about how much I've messed up this area. This is a disaster. This is a disaster. Truly a disaster. Uh, I mean, try doing that. I mean, this that's not gonna make a difference, is it? Okay. You know what? This is. I feel like this is a problem for another potato in another episode. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, Captain of Industry. This is a great game. Uh, I'm really looking forward to checking out the uh, the new stuff. Uh, we'll see what happens uh, in the next episode. Thanks ever so watching, uh, for, so much for watching right now. Uh, my name, of course, has been Open Potato. Thanks as ever to the fantastic support over on the Patreon page, patreon.com forward slash Open Potato. Thanks to Banana and, and, and Aurelio from the two twenty five dollars plus tier patrons. Thank you very much for watching, folks. I'll see you next time. Bye.